You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Thanks for stopping by today. Hopefully you enjoy checking out my candy videos. Now, I was in the grocery store actually doing grocery shopping for the family, and I always seem to head into the candy aisle. I don't know why. Probably because I'm just looking for different items that I've never tried before. This is one of the items I found. It is the Warheads Galactic Mix Cubes. Uh, Black Hole Cherry, Cosmic Punch, and Rocket Raspberry. Now, I have other stuff that I'll show you at the end, but I really wanted to check these out and let you see them. Uh, let's see. Warheads Galactic Mix Cubes, a celestial mystery of the sour kind. Will you fall into Black Hole Cherry? Get a Cosmic Punch of Darker Matter or ride the Rocket Raspberry to the pink side of the moon. You won't know till you take your first bite, which I am looking forward to. Now, normally when you see candy like this, it's in a more colorful bag. Even though it's colorful, it's not the normal colors you would see with candy. The dark blacks, the purples. Uh, it almost looks like, I don't know if you've seen people, how they paint the planets with spray paint and they'll put a circle down and they'll spray the black and then they'll make little splatters around the outside. That's kind of what it looks like in the middle with the Warheads guy. And then they have the three candies on the package, like the black hole cherry, it almost looks like smoke coming out of it, or some kind of mystical, uh, yeah, I don't know what you would call it, uh, what would you call it? Like mystical, eerie looking, you know when dry ice creates that kind of cool look, that's what it looks like. Cosmic Punch, uh, a little bit different, it's almost like, it's like it's popping out of there, and then this Rocket Raspberry, it's like ooey gooey stuff coming out, and it says new on the package. So it's a chewy candy, natural flavor. There's all the nutritional facts. Let's see. What do I have to do? Well, I have to open it. So let me grab my scissors off to the side. I think I'm gonna sort these out. So I will put that there. And then I will get all three flavors out for you. And of course, I will definitely give them a taste. So if you saw something like this in the store, would you try it? Okay, so mm, it's got a very, an extremely strong smell. Let me get another bowl here. Uh, hold on a second. Decided on a plate instead, so I'll put that there. That's why I can give you that nice little dumping sound. Okay, so the whole bag, they're all the same color on the outside. And they kind of look like it's a little red there, a little blue there, and a little purple there, but it's not. They're all the same color on the outside, so I will not be able to sort. So let's get rid of my sorting. I thought maybe you'd be able to tell from the outside, but you can't. They're a very dark, bluish, deep looking. I'll let you take a look at that while I grab my trusty little knife and a cutting board. Yes, I'm walking behind the camera right now. I was not prepared. I normally do cut things open, but not this time. I don't know why. They just look so cool. Let me just grab one, and then let me give it a little, little cut here. Okay, so the first one I cut, the color on the inside is the same color on the outside. So that has to be, I'm guessing, the black cherry. I don't know. We shall see as I check out more here. Are they all exactly the same? Okay, that's exactly the same. And you don't know till you try it? I would say slightly deceiving because it looks like, oh, there we go. So this one's a really deep red on the inside. Okay, let me give you a little different cutting camera angle. That's what we'll call it. The cutting camera angle. I'll move these here next to me so as I cut, you can see the cut. Okay, that's the same as the last one. It's like a really deep color on the inside. So we've gotten two unique colors. Okay, that's the blue. I can't wait to try one. My mouth is actually watery. Now the outside is like a very crusty. Okay, so this one is, I, I'm gonna say slightly different. So those are the three colors, I believe. You can kind of see it. 
This one here is more red, this one's more blue, and this is the in-between. That's what I'm guessing. That's another one of these. Would you agree here? I'll put one of each color. And I'll put this in between them so you can kind of see the variance there. Come on. Come on. They're sticky. Would you agree that is three different colors? Okay, so we have found all three colors. I'm going to eat this first one on the right. This one has got to be the Rocket Raspberry, you think? Or the black? I don't know. We'll see. Okay, the flavor is very strong. And I'm going to say that's the raspberry. This one here, I'm going to say is the Cosmic Punch. Now, with the sugar crystals on the outside, you get a little crispiness to it. Mm -hmm. That is Punch. And the last one, is this one. Let's see. This tastes like cherry. Mm-hmm. So that's it. Cherry. Rocket Raspberry. Cosmic Punch. Are they sour? Barely. There's almost no sourness in them. So if you want that really good sour, you're not going to get it with these. And you don't know what you're eating because you're just going to grab them. Mmm. The flavor is excellent. It's really strong. Like if you don't bite it right away, and just keep that in your mouth. Mmm. -hmm. It's good. It's good. I got to have two more. One. Two. The big question is, would I try these again? Yes, I would definitely try them again. And yes, I'll probably finish this whole bag. But everybody in the family gets to try them after I try them. So I usually get the first dibs. Mm, very good. So the cubes themselves are about, what would you say, just under a half inch, maybe three eighths by three eighths. They look like little squares. And uh, the coloring on that side is very dark. It's like a crispy, sugary coating. And you got very dark colors on the inside. I'm going to say overall, I'm happy with the flavor. The sourness, mm, if you love sour and that's what you're going for, this is not going to do it for you because it's just not sour enough. Other than that, oh yeah, let me show you. Okay, so I was on this shopping spree. And here's another item that I found, which I've never seen, which I thought was pretty unique. They're called Blow Pops Inside Outs. Have you ever seen those? I have never seen those. And then Rips. Have you ever seen Rips? I've never tried Rips. I got five, four colors of Rips. They're like these strips. And you rip them off the rolls. I got Rainbow Reaction. Grape. Uya? Uva? And then blue raspberry. Oh, that's a different language. Sorry. <laughs> Didn't realize that. I thought maybe that was part of it. And then mango chili. Mmm. Now, this is a weird one. They're called big rolls. And they're grilled seaweed. I thought they would be interesting. I've been kind of enjoying the seaweed more and more. And I'm hoping I can uh, enjoy these. I don't know. We got uh, classic favor, tasty and easy. Barbecue sauce, this is the classic, and then this is the spicy grilled squid. Ooh, doesn't that look exciting? And then, last but not least, it's a twofer, because I thought, well, I've never done these before, these Pringles. I got one called Scorching Barbecue, and then the Scorching Cheddar, and then the last one is this Hot ones, scorching hot ones, and uh, like a salsa verde, I think that is. And then I've got these magic milk straws, 
which I've done before in the SpongeBob variety, but not this variety. So I've got bubble gum, cookies and cream, and chocolate. So I think I'd match each one. Do it all in one video, though. A big taste testing of the Pringles. So let me know what you think. What do you want to see next? You tell me. And thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, look forward to these videos coming up later. I was putting these away, and I noticed inside the bag is even like a dark pinkish purple. So when you look in there, you could barely even see the candy. It's so dark in there. I thought that was cool. And yes, I was taking a thumbnail. That's the picture you see as the thumbnail. And that was all the little sugar crystals that came off the candy. Again, thanks for watching. Later! If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a Lucky Penny, pick it up.